Okay, thanks for coming, everyone. Um, police are investigating the death of a man after his arrest at Angerston last night. At about 9.50 on Tuesday, the 7th of February, patrols were called to an area on Breakneck Hill Road at Penrice after reports that a man was driving erratically and had damaged some property there. Patrols saw the man's car, a green Subaru, in Penrice Avenue, where he allegedly drove at police before speeding away. The car was not pursued by police. At about 10.40pm, police received another report that the man had driven to a business on Stockwell Road at Angerston and was behaving erratically. Patrols went to Stockwell Road and arrested the man in relation to the earlier property damage. He died shortly afterwards at the scene, despite medical assistance being provided by police and ambulance officers. Detectives from the Major Crime Investigation Branch are investigating the cause and circumstances of the man's death and will prepare a report for the State Coroner. The death is being treated as a death in custody as set out in the Coroner's Act. This is a difficult incident for all those directly affected by the man's death as well as the police officers who were on scene. At this stage an investigation is underway and police will prepare a report for the coroner. This investigation is in its infancy and all aspects will be considered throughout the investigation and as I said a report will be prepared for the coroner. Did this man injure himself in custody and was an ambulance called in this injury? As I said, everything will be investigated in the investigation. It's in its infancy. Uh, I can confirm that police and ambulance attended. Is the man known to police prior? Uh, I'm not prepared to comment on that. Um, Neighbours said that um, it was unusual to see him um, acting in such a way. Is it, does it look like maybe he might have been using drugs or alcohol? Well, I'm sure the investigation will look at that aspect. Was, was the man being restrained when he collapsed? As I said, the investigation will be prepared for the coroner. It's in its infancy um, and, you know, it's an independent investigation for the coroner and so I can't say much at this stage. Um, can you reveal if there was any struggle at all when he was being arrested at the time? Uh, like I said, I'm not prepared to go into details at this moment. The investigation needs to be carried out thoroughly. It's in its infancy. Police witnesses and other witnesses have been spoken to and a report will be prepared for the coroner. Was, was a taser used at any stage? As I said, it will all be in the investigation. There's been a few incidents of late where vehicles have been used as weapons, not so much about this incident, but in general. Is that quite concerning for police? Well, I think any high-risk driving is concerning for police. It's a very difficult situation to know whether to pursue or not to pursue and we have very strict requirements around how that's handled including independent oversight and of course it's got to be proportional to the offence. Do you know what type of damage he caused in that area? No I don't, area? sorry. Why didn't police follow him when, when he was on the street? What happened in between them being there? And... I don't have the answer to that. Was he arrested inside the house, inside the car? Was he, uh, he was. It was at a premises, a business premises on Stockwell Road. He had left the car and he was outside. He was in a business premises on Stockwell Road. Uh, just going back to your answer, it's uh, all the circumstances will be investigated um, uh, as to whether they could have at that stage or couldn't have, and uh, that'll be part of the report. So, did he at any stage drive at police? As I said, that'll be part of the investigation. I think uh, I'm not trying to be awkward, but. Uh, you know, this is an investigation now that's in its infancy. It goes to the coroner and, you know, we're still right at the beginning of the investigation. So I, I want to let it remain independent and not put a view either way uh, as to the actions because that will all be dealt with in the investigation. So thanks very much.